Hey guys, Rob with Evolution Tabs. Today I'm gonna to be talking to you about the switches that we offer, uh, the pluses and minuses, the pros and cons of each switch, and the differences um, for the different ways to control the tabs that you have. Okay, so we have just finished installing on this Malibu boat, and now it's come time to decide which switch we're gonna go with. We have a couple of really great options here, and so I wanted to talk to you about each of these. The first option I'm gonna to talk to you about is our Evolution Tabs joystick controller. This controller is gonna come with a billet mount that you can mount anywhere you want to. You can mount it on your armrest facing up. You can mount it horizontally on the side of, of the boat near the throttle, or you can mount it down by your knee and all of these locations work really well. You simply install the Phillips screws through the top you can push a screwdriver through the holes in there and then put a set screw in to lock it into place. This controller is revolutionary for the industry. This is something that has just come out and essentially to use it, it's very, very simple. If you are surfing, you want to surf on the left, you simply push to the left. If you want to surf to the right, you push to the right. If you want to make a micro adjustment and you want to raise the tab slightly, you can go down diagonally. It'll only work one of the tabs. If you want to put both tabs down for trim tabs, you simply push the joystick forward and to retract both, you're going to push that down. Now, I love this tab because it's so intuitive. There's not a lot of thought process. There's nothing to get confused. It's very simple. Surf left, surf right, trim your boat to the left, trim your boat to the right deploy both tabs. Very, very self-explanatory. Uh, this switch also comes with an auto retract feature. So when you turn off your key switch, which is linked to this purple wire, the tabs will automatically retract. That way, you know, they're not gonna be left down when you get on the trailer and head home. Um, you can also wire that to a separate switch. Uh, these are available on Amazon, very easy to find and so the tabs won't retract whenever you go to neutral. The next option I want to talk to you about is the classic rocker switches. We've been using these for years. I've been using these on my own personal boats and they're really a great option. So they're very, very simple. In order to deploy the tabs, you simply push down to retract them, you pull up. These are essentially power window switches. They're super intuitive, very easy to use. Uh, new for this year, we've actually made this little billet mounting bracket so you don't need to cut a hole in your armrest. We've covered it in previous videos. This can be, these switches can be removed. They'll fit in any carling slot on your dash, or you can mount this directly into your armrest, or you can mount it anywhere else in the boat that suits you using this bracket so you only have to drill a couple of small holes rather than cutting a large hole for the switch itself. It's gonna come complete with a wire harness that looks like this. It's very simple. All you have is a positive and negative line going into it. Uh, it's fuse protected. That fuse can be removed if you're gonna use a breaker like you do in Malibu boats. I love these switches. Like I said, they're very intuitive. Now, if you're surfing, what you're gonna do if you wanna surf on the regular side is simply push the button on the regular side. If you want to surf on the goofy side, you're going to push the button on the goofy side. If you're surfing and you wanna do a transfer, what you're gonna do is push one down, pull one up. In order to retract both tabs, you simply pull both tabs up. You can use these, again, as fully functional trim tabs. I love it. You're just gonna put your fingers down and it's very, very intuitive. Uh, with most of our boats, we've really dialed these in to where you're simply gonna deploy the tabs all the way. You're not gonna mess with the angles very much. Um, they're very, very easy and simple to use. Okay, the last option that I wanna to talk to you about is the Lenco controller. Lenco LED integrated controller. The nice thing about this switch is that it tells you how far the tabs are deployed or retracted. It also has an auto retract feature. When you turn off your key switch, it will retract. These switches along with the joystick controller use the Deutsch connectors. So it's plug and play. We're simply gonna plug everything in. It comes with our wire harness with Deutsch connectors. So connection is super simple to the actuators and the switch. Now, the thing that I've always had an issue with this switch is that if you want to say surf on the left, you're gonna push down on the left. And if you wanna surf on the right, you push down on the left or on the right. To retract the tabs, you're going to push both buttons. 
But now if you want to do a transfer, what could be difficult is if your surf fan left is you're gonna to have to put your fingers in two different locations, push this one up and this one down, or this one down and this one up. And it's sincerely not difficult, but maybe just takes a little bit more thinking as far as which button you want to push. Um, again, to deploy the tabs, you simply push down, to pull them up, you push up. To mount this, you can mount this anywhere in your boat. It has a large locking nut. All you need to drill is about a two inch hole. And we will actually send you one of these as well. A little mounting bracket so you don't need to cut any large holes in your boat if you don't want to. And simply two screws. All three of these are great options. Uh, just talking about cost, the joystick controller is the standard controller which we opt offer with our packages. Now, if you want to save a couple hundred dollars, you can go with the rocker switches. And if you want to spend an extra hundred dollars, you can go with the LED switches. So there you have it. You have three great options for controlling your Evolution tabs. I hope you enjoyed this video and you understand better how these work.